So here I have another hot plate uh, which is made from two ceramics. So each ceramic, uh, I mean on each ceramic I put these copper strips uh, and each ceramic I paint with a conductive ink. Uh, and then when I finish the painting I uh, put together these two ceramics and leave it. So and you get this sandwich. So on both sides is ceramic and in the middle is this uh, conductive ink. So I will run this one on 300 watts and yeah I will see what I will get out from this one. Ah, okay. So right now I have 105 degrees C. Three. 167. Yeah. Cool. 181. So I increase the volt, uh, I mean the power on 350 watts. And I get uh, 200. 43 Okay, not cool Not cool uh, This one is too hot Over one, uh, 260 degrees C. So I need something. Okay, I will leave it like this. Yeah, I don't know what is the temperature. Yeah, the water is hot. Yeah, I cannot measure the temperature because I'm out of range. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Okay. So I have 350 watts on this one. Uh, Okay, and here is really, really warm. <laughs> so actually, you can use this one like heater also. Oh, Jesus. And also the ceramic will store the, uh, the heat for quite long uh, time. 
it depends on the thickness of the ceramic so I will leave it that this water will boil So yeah, that's it. I will stop right now. Yeah. So the water is boiling. Really, really awesome. So I think 350 watts is a little bit too high because you get really really intense heat so I will finish right here <laughs> awesome. I'll take this one to the outside. Oh, Jesus. Ah, oh, this is hot. Ooh, I can feel it from here. So, guys, uh, don't try this at home because it's really dangerous so I make this one because I just test um, if I can make some hot plate uh, with this conductive ink so actually I did it but uh, I have some sacrifice but yeah this was only a test and yeah we see us.